Hello, today I want to show you another great feature in CAMORS. If you have a SOLIDWORKS assembly or a CAMORS assembly, or even if you made an assembly in a different CAD software, uh, the CAMORS SOLIDS has an um, ability to recognize the assembly. So, right now I have an assembly made in um, SOLIDWORKS, an assembly uh, with uh, the raw material, a vise, the table of the machine, and of course the part I want to to machine. Chemors has a, a great feature. We call this feature mill assemblies, uh, where you you can define all the fixtures, all the elements you need to define in order to have a real simulation. Um, you will see that when you are using CAMORS, uh, CAMORS uh, assemblies, the CAMORS feature tree is different. You have to define the, the part, the part manager, uh, uh, the part you will uh, need to be machined. And in CAMORS operation tree, we have now a new tab called fixtures where, where, uh, where you, uh, we can define all the elements that are fixed in this, um, in this, uh, for this part. And all these elements, I will see it in a simulation. In a um, usual CAMORS uh, 2.5 axis or 3 axis uh, operation, uh, if I want to simulate uh, a fixture, I have to define a sketch. In, with this, uh, with this, uh, uh, with this feature, Camors mill assemblies, uh, you can always, before the simulation, simulate uh, the machine of this part. So, as I told you earlier, Camors feature tree is a little bit different. The part manager and, and the setup. I define all the features for this part. And in CAMWORKS feature tree, I have a new tab called fixtures, where, where I define the vice and the table. And now, when I run the simulation, you will see that I can see all the fixtures defined in the earlier. So let's start the simulation. Face mill, then uh, contouring on the outside of this part, and then the pocket inside, and then of course the engraving. So this is the another cool feature of Camors, which is called Camors Mill Assemblies. Thank you very much for your attention. Until the next time, bye bye.